Hey, I'm in tune with me. You should get in tune with you. Ain't no place I'd rather be than right here up in the booth. Holla back if you relate when you doing what you do. I know I'm in tune with me. You should get in tune with you. Hey, yeah, peace and blessings. Yeah, peace and blessings. I'm just. Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Welcome to CN Take, man. My name is Jay Sin. Coming back with another one, man. Listen, y'all already know the most I don't woke us up this morning. Let's take this opportunity to be great, you know what I'm saying? But, man, look at that sun. That sun beaming down on us, man. It's beaming down on us, man, letting us know, like, listen, we up. We in it. You know what I'm saying? And it's just the beginning. You know, the most High tapped us. Gave us another opportunity to get it right. You know what I'm saying? And listen, we got to fight. You know what I'm saying? How you going to get it right, but you ain't willing to fight, bro? You know what I mean? That's why we over here. I thought that's why we was over here. You know what I'm saying? That's why we getting into this truth. That's why we trying to get our health right, bro, because it's a fight. You know what I'm saying? Anything that you want to want to do right, bro, you got to fight for it, bro. Righteousness it's a battle. It's a fight. It's a fight to the finish, bruh. You know what I'm saying? That's why the most high, man, like, you know, he bless you when you don't quit, bruh. I'm telling you, you know, and that's why I wanted y'all to see that clip, bruh, posted by No Fab Club. Shout out to No Fab Club. Always posting that good stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? I know that was a simple clip, man, but, you know, it's facts right there. You know what I'm saying? And if you don't, Get control of that lust, bro. Listen, bro, it's gonna be the fastest way to your demise, bro. You know what I'm saying? As soon as you, you know, quit on yourself, soon as you quit on this journey, soon as you quit on your health, and you give in to it, man, listen, bro. It's gonna be all downhill from there, bro. Because what you pretty much doing is opening up a gateway you know, for demonic energy to enter you, you know what I'm saying? Just through lust, you know what I'm saying? Because it ain't just about the cheeks, bro. You know what I'm saying? You can lust for anything out here, bro. You know what I'm saying? You can lust for, you can lust for women, you can lust for money, you know what I'm saying? You can lust for attention, you can lust for all of these things, bro. You know, that'll have you, listen, bro, on a downward spiral. Because while you doing all that lusting for everything else, bro, you're not paying attention to your spirit. You're not paying attention to the most high. You're not paying attention to your health. You're not paying attention to your well-being. You're not paying attention to nothing, bro. You just, you know, when you lust what you think lust is, bro, that's all you think about. That's all you want. You think that's the end all and be all when you lusting. You know what I'm saying? So... You know, you really don't care about nothing else. You don't care about other people's feelings. You don't care about the spirit. You don't care about not even your family, bruh. You know what I'm saying? How many people we done seen destroy their marriage, destroy their family, destroy their kids, all in the name of lust, bruh? You know what I'm saying? When they cheating, when they stepping out, when they, you know, putting, you know, money and attention and cars and all that stuff before, the, before they... You know, family, before, you know, the most high, you know, before anything else. Listen, bro, you destroy everything. You destroying yourself and don't even realize it. You know what I'm saying? And when you lusting, bro, in your mind, you think you winning. You think you winning. You think you winning while you fapping. You think you winning when you busting. 
You know what I'm saying? You think you winning while you watching porn. Oh, yeah, because you feel good for a little second. You know what I'm saying? You think you winning when you get numbers, when you in them DMs. You know what I mean? You think you winning. You feel like you winning in that moment. You feel like you the man. But listen, bro, you not. You know what I'm saying? You not the man. You not, you not winning. You know what I'm saying? Because all you doing is sinning in that, bro. You know what I mean? You sinning, and guess what, bro? You're going to have to pay for it, too. You know what I'm saying? The ultimate price. So you got to get control of that lust and never stop, bro. Never quit working. That's the most important thing, bro. Never quit working. No matter what you're going through, you get right up and you keep on fighting, bro. You know, the most high honor and respect that, bro, because a lot of people is folding right now, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and the reason why they folding is because they, they have no faith. They losing faith. You know what I'm saying? And you not losing faith when you get up, bro. You still fighting for your spirit. You still fighting for your health. You know what I'm saying? You still fighting for righteousness. That's why the most high love that. That's why the most high going to continue to bless you with strength, good energy. You know what I'm saying? Positivity. He going to keep he going to keep blessing you with peace because that's what you seeking, bro. You got to understand when people out here lusting, bro, you got to understand they have no peace because you know, all they hearing is voices, you know, want and pleasure, you know what I'm saying? Wanting to be seen, you know what I mean? All they, all they hear is voices telling them to do wrong, bro. You know what I'm saying? So where you think that you going to have some peace in that? You're not going to have no peace in that. You know what I mean? You dealing with torment over there. You fighting demons over there. You know what I mean? You got to, you, you living a life of confusion over there when you lusting, bro. You know, and you can't focus on anything, bro. You can't focus on anything meaningful. You know what I'm saying? You can't focus on getting to the next level. You can't focus on losing weight. You can't focus on your mental health. You can't focus on your kids. You can't focus on the relationship that you in. You know what I mean? You can't focus on the most high. You can't focus on the word. You know what I mean? You can't focus on the truth. You can't do that. You know what I'm saying? Because lust takes over your whole body like a disease because it's like a cancer, bro. You got to understand, lust is like a cancer. And you and you dang going right. Just from that clip, bro, you will be tossing and turning all night. You know what I mean? Thinking about whatever it is that you lusting for. You're going to be you gonna be tossing and turning all night. You're going to be on your phone. And listen, bro, you know, that's going to be what's ultimately draining you and it's going to stop you dead in your tracks from accomplishing anything in your life. You won't be able to accomplish nothing. You can forget about it. Oh, you got goals, you got dreams. Listen, bro, your lust gonna tell you to get rid of that. Get rid of that. We need we need sex. Get rid of that. We need drugs. We need to feel good. We need pleasure. Get rid of that. We need attention, bro. Get rid of that. We don't need the light. That's what lust tell you. Lust convince you that you don't need the light, bro. That's that demon. That's that lustful demon. You know what I'm saying? That's why the most high don't want us in that type of mind state, in that type of spirit, in that type of energy, bro. He don't want that in us because it don't do us no good, bro, because you letting the flesh take over you. You know what I'm saying? And what we all know is that the flesh make you less, bro. The flesh bump you down the level every time you give in. The flesh, listen, bro, you know what I'm saying? The flesh like that, the flesh like that one friend that come over that you can't get rid of, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because the flesh has nothing to do. You ever had that that one friend that ain't got nothing else to do and they with whatever? Hey, man, I don't care. I ain't got nothing to do. You know what I mean? But nigga, hey, you know what I'm saying? Like, I do. You know what I mean? But that flesh, like, you listen, bro, that lust. It's like that friend that won't leave, bro. You know what I'm saying? Always sticking around. Don't got nothing else to do but torment you. Got nothing else to do but push you. Got nothing else to do but urge you. You know what I'm saying? So that's why you got to get control of that, bro. Otherwise, you won't never have, you can, You won't never get rid of them. So you could do the things that need to be done in your life, bro. You know what I'm saying? The things that need to be done in your life that could get you to the next level, bro. You know what I'm saying? That could have you working out your own salvation, bro. That could have you helping others, helping yourself and helping others, helping and changing the things around you, bro. You won't never get to that. You know what I'm saying? If you don't kick that lust up out your house, bro. If you don't kick that lust up out your spirit. If you don't kick that lust up out your mind, bro. Listen, bro. You're going to be running out of time. You're going to be running out of time. You ain't going to have no time for nothing else, bro. 
You know what I mean? Lust stingy. Them demons stingy, bro. You know what I mean? Think about it, bro. Think about all the demons that you had to fight, bro. All of them stingy. Every, de every demon that I had to fight was stingy. Just wanted to take over everything in my life. You know what I'm saying? Alcohol. Al cool. That demon. Took over. Wanted to take over everything in my life. Control everything. And then when it didn't get his way, it gave me health problems. When it didn't get his way, it gave me the shakes. When it didn't get his way, it was eating away at my, my brain cells, bro. To where I couldn't think. To where I couldn't formulate my speech. You know what I'm saying? To where I couldn't do nothing without it. You know what I'm saying? You think about it, man. Sex, bro. Bussing. You know what I mean? Lust. Do, do the same thing, bro. That's all you think about. You know what I mean? You can't even see a woman without undressing her. You can't even see a woman without thinking about doing something nasty to her. You can't even see a woman and be polite and be a masculine man and, 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 and appreciate them for their feminine energy. No, nah, lust don't want you to do that. Lust don't want you to do that, bruh. Lust wants you to think nasty thoughts. Think about what you could do to them. You know what I mean? Lust wants you to go watch some porn and, and, and want you to, you know, act out what you see on that screen on, on these women out here. That's what lust do. Lust don't want you to think about getting to the next level. Lust don't want you to think about the most high. You know what I'm saying? The lust wants you to just bust and keep on busting and busting and busting until you have nothing. You know what I mean? Till you have nothing left, bro, and still won't mow. It still ain't enough. Still won't mow, bro. That's why you got to get rid of that. You know what I'm saying? The lust for attention. What people do, they on social media all day trying to get a rise out of people, trying to get love from people, trying to get likes from people, trying to get views from people, trying to get news from people. You know what I'm saying? That's what they do. That's what that attention, bro. You don't want to lust for nothing out here, bro. If you're going to lust for anything, lust for the spirit, lust for the most high. You know what I'm saying? Lust for more good energy, lust for peace. You know what I'm saying? Lust for prosperity. You know what I mean? Lust for positivity. You know what I mean? Lust for those things. You know what I mean? Don't lust for what this world wants you lusting for. Why you think they show all of this crap on TV? They want you lusting for Burger King. They want you lusting for these celebrities. You know what I mean? They want you to they want you to they want you to lust for nonsense. You know? Because that's all they got to offer, bro. And y'all going to hear me keep talking about the world because the world ain't ish. You know what I mean? Look at the state that is in. You know what I mean? Had a little back and forth. Like, not I I wouldn't even say a back and forth, but I had posted a comment because I had seen a, a a post where this guy was just talking about everything that's going on in Russia. And I just said, like, look, this is this is biblical. Everything that's happening right now is supposed to be happening. All praises to the most high. And then some guy jumping there, he called me a weirdo or whatnot. And just like I told y'all yesterday, you can't be going back and forth with people and all that other stuff. You know what I'm saying? But you know, I just told them, like, look, that's why I have peace and y'all scared right now. And, you know, they are. They are panicking and going through all these things that they can't control. You know what I'm saying? And then the guy, you know, I started joking with him because on his profile, he said he's a comedian. So, you know, I felt a little, you know, I threw a little few jokes out there laughing. Like, seriously, wasn't even upset or nothing, but he just get, getting upset. I even apologized, bro. It was funny. I was laughing, but I still was like, OK, my bad, man. You said you're a comedian on your on your uh, on your profile. So, you know, I thought you could take a joke, you know, a couple jokes or whatnot. But he couldn't even take a joke, bro. You know, he erased his comments, disappeared, and all of that stuff, man. But listen, bro, it's just it's just like crazy. Don't even get caught up in a, all of that stuff, man. Like I said, some people, you know, they just they post stuff and, you know, they expect it to not be, you know, any consequences for the things that they say to anybody. But like I said, I didn't I didn't even take it personal. But a lot of these people out here, they panicking, bro. And they don't know what to do because they have no peace and they have no faith. That was why I wanted to tell y'all that they have no peace and they have no faith. If they have faith in the most high, they wouldn't be like, oh, my God, Russia doing this. Ukraine doing that. Israel doing this. The United States. Doing they, they wouldn't even be, you know what I'm saying? Like letting that just, you know, affect them. You know what I'm saying? That's why you got to continue to seek the most high's face. Get into the word, man, and understand you will have peace in your life. You know what I'm saying? But a lot of people don't, bro. They, they get to talk and they spew stuff out. They think they can say anything to anybody. And then, you know what I'm saying? When you, you, you know, you got a little joke, a joke or two, you know what I'm saying? Not even upset. 
you know, and then they go run for the hills. It's like people that just have no faith, they have no peace, no sense of humor. And the Most High want us to have a sense of humor. At the end of the day, he don't want us all just serious all the time. Yeah, you know what I mean? We need to carry ourselves in a certain way, a certain manner. You know what I'm saying? As men, you know, we need to be stoic. You know, we 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 need to have that edge. You know what I'm saying? But that don't mean he still want us around walking around stiff and not being who we are at the end of the day. You know, but this world want to take that away from your DNA. They don't want you to have a sense of humor. They want you to do what they want you to do. They, you know, they don't want you happy. They don't want to see you smile. They want you down like they down. And we can't be down like they down. We got to stay up. You know what I'm saying? We got to stay up, bro. So stop all that lusting for the BS and keep doing you. Keep getting up. Keep fighting, bro, because you worth it. You worth the fight. You know what I'm saying? Don't let nobody tell you you worth the fight, bro. And you can never let your guard down with this lust. You can never let your guard down with these demons, bro, because they want your semen. They want it bad. They want your energy. They want it bad. They want your spirit. They want it bad. They want your health. They want it bad. They want your peace. They want it bad. They want everything, bro. You know what I'm saying? So as soon as you let your guard down, you already know. Hands down, man down. Hands down, man down. So you got to stay prayed up. You got to keep your, your hands up to the most high. And when y'all pray, don't even put your hands together, bro. You put both hands up to the most high. He wants your, he wants your hands up and your head up too. You're not supposed to put your head down. You know what I'm saying? You're not supposed to put your head down when you're praying to the most high. You look up with your, with both hands up. You know what I'm saying? And you confess, you repent, you praise, you thank, you do all of that, bro, because the most high is everything. The most high is everything, bro. And he doing something great with our life, bro. He doing something great with our spirit, bro. He doing something great for us. You know what I mean? Just for us to even be here and be able to talk how we talk. You know what I mean? Be able to live how we live and be coming out of that darkness like that, coming out of that slumber like that. You know what I'm saying? Come on, bro. You can't tell me that it ain't, you know what I'm saying, that the most high is not in our presence. You know what I'm saying? You can't tell me that. So understand, bro, we got to keep going in this walk, in this truth, all right? And that's my word, man. My name is Jay Sin, the Sin Take. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace.